Thanks for joining. Today we're going to do some more fun math with Legos. We're going to do multiplication activity number three. So first thing we always do is put the video on pause for about five minutes while we explore with our blocks in any way we like, have fun, and once you're done, turn the video back on and we'll continue. All right, everybody, we've had fun exploring with our blocks. Now it's time to do multiplication activity number three, and we're gonna start by putting down some four dot blocks. Here's one four dot block, one, two, three, four. We're gonna put down eight four dot blocks. Here's two, three, four dot blocks, four four dot blocks. We're gonna count how many dots are in eight four dot blocks. Here's another one. Five, six, seven, eight. Do you have your eight on yours? Okay. Let's count the dots. How much is four times eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, and 32. Eight times four is 32. But what if we switch the numbers around a little bit and if I got mixed up and I started to put down eight dot blocks, what if I put down four eight dot blocks instead of eight four dot blocks? Let's see what happens. So here is one eight dot block. Here's another eight dot block. Here's three and here's four. Look, they're the same length. They're the same size. Let's count them up to make sure. We have four eight dot blocks one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, and thirty-two. So it's the same. When we do four times eight, we can do four eight dot blocks or eight four dot blocks and we still get the same number. And that's called the commutative property of multiplication. That's a big word, but it's important. It works for addition and multiplication. It doesn't matter which way we put the numbers. It adds up to the same amount, whether we do four times eight or eight times four. It's the same thing. It doesn't work for subtraction and it doesn't work with division but it does work with multiplication and addition. So good job. Let's pause and draw our work. All right, everyone. Welcome back. We've drawn our work. Here's our work. So let's see what we've drawn. And here's the way I drew it. Remember this sheet can be downloaded from the site or you can draw this on regular paper it doesn't matter so here's our first one that we did eight four blocks one two three four five six seven eight equals 32 and then we did four eight dot blocks one two three four eight dot blocks equals 32 and here's what we wrote. I put my name on the paper, John, and I made a little picture there. And I put down the problem that we did, four times eight equals 32. And over here I put eight times four equals 32. And then I wrote that out. Eight times four equals 32 and 4 times 8 equals 32. Nice work. 
we also need to mark our progress charts. So here's my progress chart that we've been working on. Oh, we've done a lot of work here so far. Lots of work. So I did activity number three, so I colored three, activity three, I colored it yellow. And if you, and you can download this paper to mark your progress, or you can color it on a regular sheet of paper like this. And I have multiplication. We did the third activity. So this block shows three. One, two, three. We did the third activity. Nice job, everybody. We did a nice job today working with multiplication, activity number three. Nice work. Well, today I've got a little something special to keep those blocks from falling on my head. I have a fan. That'll blow everything away. So no blocks will fall on our head today. I guarantee it. So let's turn the fan on. I put some little ribbons here so that we can see. I'll point it up to keep those rib those blocks from falling on my head. Awesome. Let's see. Oh, good work. Now those blocks won't fall in our heads. Love you all. See you next time.